It matches my shirt. Good morning. Drop it. Drop it. Hey. Good boy. Oh. <laughs> really? It's all about the pink one right now? This is the only freebie I care about. Right now. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Huh. I'm gonna get it. Huh, I told you. 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 Go. Huh. Yeah. No. Yes. Okay. There. No. I bought a VR yesterday. I broke down, copped the Oculus, and the only thing I'm looking forward to today is strapping it on Dirty Aaron's fucking head. What are you fucking creeping up on, son? Back up, son. So feet up. Hopping around all the time. Let's go. Whoa. Okay. Abner, your ears flopped over. Your ear. Ooh, 743. Nobody cares about this but me, but well, some of you care. Some of you are tattooers, but this Fudo Miu machine customized for me came in. So hype about. Room is a disaster from trying to uh, stream the Rift last night. Quest, I mean. I mean, what the fuck I have. Box from last week. Oh shit. Whoa, you can still see the controllers. <laughs> yeah. So the game that you're gonna play is called something, I don't even remember. Thing. Okay, stationary. so that's your, that's your stationary Whoa. area. The lodge? Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. You're gone. Yeah, yeah, I'm gone. There should be like Exorcist. There should be a couple of games. The Exorcist. Well, yeah, but there should be two other games. Super hot. VR. There you go. Super hot is what you want to play. Oh with. shit. <laughs> All right, pick this gun up. Oh. Yeah, you have to. Oh shit. What world do we live in? Where are you? I don't remember this part. I'm, oh, you're in the. You're, are you in the fucking? I just to, put a computer in the desk. Yeah, you mean a disc in the computer? Yeah. Pull, I'll look above you. There's a VR headset. I pull that down onto your head. What the fuck? I'm in VR in the VR. This yeah. is red dude ahead. Yeah, he's gonna fuck you up. You have to punch him. No. Yeah. Did you make a fist? Yeah, I just made a fist by holding it. I'm just ringing it in real life. Hold on. And if they shoot you, dodge your bullets, yeah. hit them, grab their guns. If there's anything to throw, is there anything blue? Look down. Is there anything around you? What is that? I grabbed the gun. But now shoot that fool. Wait, but now they all disappeared again. I had to hit this dude. Oh, I'm doing okay, though. There's a dude in the helicopter. Yeah. Oh my god, he shot eight bullets. Yeah. Too slow. There's no way. They hit me already? Yeah, you're too slow. You have to grab that first gun. Did it die? Is that about Man, it? it just went black. Like, it went to... My hands hit that part of the... Uh, where? It should be in the upper right hand corner. Oh yeah, 59%. Okay, yeah, you somehow hit the smallest button on the fucking thing and turned it off. And Alrighty, okay, this time I've got a strategy. I'm gonna hit the- Oh, he's behind me now! Oh shit. You motherfucker. <laughs> Come on. Right in the nuts, how'd that feel, buddy? Oh! Empty clips, boy. Reload! <laughs> Yo, you know you can deflect it with your gun? Yeah, you can throw your guns at people. You can I go, caught the gun yeah. there. This shit is crazy. Yeah, I know. They get you, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. It's fucking crazy, yeah, dude. Yeah, it's crazy. I mean, it's just as good as like the VR that we played in Japan or it's anything. It's not better. Yeah, even better, honestly, like graphic-wise. The only difference between that and Japan is that they had a place set up where like yeah. they made it where you were walking around a mapped area, but you could do that at your home this if you had 500? A... Yeah, you could get one for 400. It's totally worth it. You want to go to Best Buy? Sell my green for else. Hey, I, so I got like kind of drunk feeling last night afterwards. Everybody was saying that you really have to acclimate, play it a little bit at a time until you get used to it and then it gets better and easier. Like last night I was like, dude, I don't feel good. I went and slept. Like, I mean, yeah. probably tired from my vacation, yeah. Yeah. but also, you know. How, is there a way to hook it to a TV screen so while I'm playing you can see what I'm doing? Yeah, playing? so I ordered this shit last night so I can do it. Because when I twitched last night, I just twitched myself. <laughs> just see you in the middle of the room. <laughs> It's amazing. There's parts where I'm just silent because I'm just like looking around. Tony said I look like a crackhead. He's like, I don't know what you're doing. You aren't making any noise and you're just looking around. And you got to stay strapped to your head. The HDCP block, the same thing as when you're streaming on the PlayStation. Yeah. Remember that? You have to get a switch, bypass it because nothing in streaming is normal. <coughs> oh, what we got? Oh, I think I know. Is this from the sneakers app? We're about to, we're about to find out. 
Oh no, it's not. That's that BBC. Oh you know, shit. Call it a plug. Oh you shit. How does shoot? Let's come out in a minute. These are all gonna go on sale. Well, maybe not this colorway. I don't know. Yeah. But these are all gonna. All these colorways are gonna go on sale. No branding, really. This is a perfect shoe, bro. Yeah. I get the red when they go on sale. <laughs> get them. On a discount, yeah, they're gonna go on sale for seventy-five bucks. Then I'm gonna get them half off of that. You end up get every pair of these for around forty. Nice. I rebuild a collection of some almost brandless shoes that are yeah. honestly more comfortable than ultra boots. Oh, and it's just like what it is, bro. Like these are more comfortable than ultra boots. I can wear these all day, every day. Disney, I fucking hit like thirty miles in two days, and I wore the black pair both days. My feet are the only things that didn't this hurt. This is sick. Only things that didn't hurt. Every part about me hurt. My soul hurt, my spirit hurt, my wallet hurt, patience Damn. was gone, the sweat, Shit. the heat. So the exorcist I'm gonna try? Yeah. What are you doing? I don't know what I'm Get doing. Get out of there! Dude, that series, The Boys, I started watching it. Mm -hmm. It is so good. It's literally like superheroes if it was today. Basically, this corporation owns them. Like, this corporation owns like 250 different superheroes. I can't tell where it's going, but it seems like he's gonna become like an evil villain. Do -do. What are we eating today? I don't know. What do you think? Mm. Lao Wang? Roll time save? I was actually thinking that. It's early enough. Yeah, let's go there. Do they open? I think they open at 10. That was 11. Let me look. I will too, because that I'm basically gonna fucking draw. Oh, yeah, no. so hope it's 11 at Wednesday, dude. It's Monday. Ah, packing up them Florida teas. You already know. Do you Florida. know? What, do you know what's left? Ah, uh, there'll be a little bit. Well, there. I have to go through the messages. Got the non-dropped, the Florida eyes. Little back stocks here. We're slowing down the production this week because of all these issues. We have an issue with, oh, the public doesn't even know about this, huh? Our friends, uh, this, public, no, they our don't. friends and family drop got fucked up, so we're battling with the printers today. As usual. As usual. Might not look fucked up to you, but that red's supposed to be 3M. Yeah, a lot going on. I got a lot of stuff to catch up on, so we're not doing a drop this week. But there might be a mystery bag drop coming. Well, friends and family always gets first crap. We'll see. We'll see. I'm also, you know, because the Ultra Boost, I said earlier, the these for reals are more comfortable than Ultra Boost. Yeah. I would absolutely 100% sell my PEs. I would sell the Miami Ultra Boost and I would sell Arizona State Ultra Boost at this point. Damn. Yeah, they're beat up, but I would, and I would definitely still charge a lot of money for them. But Put them in my shoe cell. Oh yeah, Dirty Earn's thinking about having a, a shoe cell. Dirty Earn so blowout. I don't want to have a bigger collection than Teddy, which I do. Just doesn't feel right. No, but I, I literally. Dirty Earn blowout. Well, green. but earlier you also thought that your green Pharrells were gonna sell for 450, which they're definitely not going to. Yes, you're out of your fucking mind. They're 11 and a half. Who cares? When's the last time you looked at the fucking stock? And you've definitely worn more than three times. I have About five. fucking footage of you all over the world and you're out of your mind. You really think that your green Pharrells are gonna go for 450? You seriously think this right now? Like, you really, that's really- I thought that was a good, I, yeah, I was you're hoping for more, but crazy. figured I'd be crazy if I wanted more than them. You're out of your mind. Let's see what they're going for. <laughs> 450. You didn't even pay 450 for them. Brand new, they're going for seven. Mm -hmm. All right, so maybe. When's the what? Wait, 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 wait. They're going for seven, or they're... someone's asking seven? What's the last sale in your size, sir? Uh, last sale 525. Okay. Brand new. Brand new. So that's what they're going for. Okay. There's just some dickhead with a pair that thinks he's gonna get 700, like it's 2016 out here. It's yeah. not. You're gonna get like 350 tops, maybe three. They're worn, dog. They are There's worn. There's been but, about 150 but, Pharrells. No, but they are. It's the only shoe you have that's worth any money. I get it. I hear you. I, I well, my you. creams, but I don't. Your think creams it. have been fucking destroyed. Oh, yeah, because they're. Those shits are worth like 100 bucks. Fuck, well, keeping those. Oh, my God. This guy. I don't know. This is so, the delusions of everybody when they sell shoes. I look at my closet and I, I don't wear almost anything in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've heard this story before. Yeah. You just sound like me now. Copycats. Well, that's true. Copycat sellers. I'm just mad because I got these Adapt Harachi. He's on the way, son. I'll be like, Made it home. A really kind of a somewhat mellow day. I'm just gonna be drawing. I've scheduled myself some days of not craziness, which is nice. I'm glad that I did that because I'm fucking exhausted. The, yeah, I mean, there's really not a lot of Ultra Boost left. Favorite pair from the start, another favorite pair from the start. Probably the best release this year. 
fucking sh like ultra boost visual wise this shoe just kind of pays homage to all the past so i like it still and i fuck with packers still but and then yeah these obviously are grails for people and i um those of you that know, I wiped off the <laughs> silver on the side by accident. That's literally that's what left an ultra boost. And there's all my hues are kind of around, but there's not. There's these that I have on, and then there's the friends and family pair and the black pair. That's all I got. My boy Geiger, boom boom, dead stock gloves. These are damn near the same though. I mean, like, there's really not too much of a difference in color. It's honestly a little more frozen, but they're pretty close. The new Yeezy colors are all just. <laughs> Still one tone off, so I'm kind of like, whatever. Nothing's really catching me right now. But that's pretty much it. I mean, there's a pair of glows floating around here, a pair of clays. These Ultra Boosts, which are restocking apparently on the third with the orange and red. So, you know, you get another shot of that. Adidas is definitely, uh, definitely going into the bag now because it doesn't seem like anything new is coming off the farm. So then I got the, obviously the Adapt Hirachi's coming. I guess there's like the slight issue of addressing, you know, there's a little bit of confusion or whatever. Obviously now I've like branched out and buying other shit. I'm not just Boost God. I'm not just wearing Adidas. I'm also not chasing after everything or really anything in particular. I'm kind of at the same place I was, well, I'm at the same place with Adidas that I was with Nike when you guys found out about me. My main thing was always like, Nike broke my heart. I used to love Nike. They broke my heart. Adidas has broken more than my heart. They've uh, broken my faith <laughs> in any kind of system that's bigger than a couple of friends. So I'm basically at this point where I just, I'm just, yeah, I'm salty towards brands. I try to find the things that I appreciate that, that they do, but it's so few and far between now. And then obviously the culture surrounding it is just insane and ridiculous. And I don't really agree with like 99.9% .9 of the shit that happens. It's all goofy and it's funny to watch, but the whole like association thing is just weird. To clarify, I will buy shoes when I find something that seems interesting. The Adapt Hirachi just seemed like the funniest thing. And then the fact that I got through it was just fucking amazing. Like I said earlier today, <clears throat> the only shoe that's comfortable to me, not only shoe that's comfortable to me, the Free Hiker is still by far the most comfortable shoe that's come out. It's obviously not wearable all the time. The colorways have been left a lot to be desired. The only person that gets to put out the colorways that we want seem to be Kith and Ronnie. The other ones just sort of fall flat. I mean, the one that Ronnie put out is putting out next it's just black on black with color hits. It's simple. It works. You can't really see the branding. It's it's what we kind of want. And the other stuff, three stripes blaring like a bat signal, is just, it's it's tired and it's old. I don't like it. Same reason I don't like the swoosh. I don't like big swooshes on the shoes. I don't like any of that shit. These are the BBC exclusives. Shout out to BBC. All over the place in these drops, so I'm glad that I copped. This is my favorite shoe of the year by far. Obviously, you guys know I love this fucking colorway. They crush, bro. Like, yes, they are mesh on the inside. I know. If you've been following me for a long time, I came out the gate and I only fucked with PK. This is different. It feels completely different. It's breathable. I like that NMD mesh. I've told you guys 150 times. I'm definitely not really trying to review this shoe right now, even though that's what's happening. Solar yellow colorway is fire. Super glad I got it. They are dope. <laughs> True size. Switch came in or this little Switch HDI switch. So did the Cape Town mouse. Shout out to the homie uh, Bigfoot actually copped for me. We got two. Uh, this one was supposed to be for somebody else, but I don't know, they haven't hit me back. It's been a while, it took a while to ship. As I went to go set up the VR um, switch, whatever, it worked fine. It works great. It works perfectly. I had the worst fucking headache maybe of my life. Couldn't really see, like terrible, bro. Awful. After two o'clock, my head was cooked. So I just went to sleep. I dead ass went to sleep at 7.30, I think. I started watching The Boys, because Aaron told me to, which was uh, actually really good, two episodes in. Anyway, uh, so I woke up super early this morning. I drew a bunch. The next like two weeks, I really need to stockpile drawing. I need to find like a, a discipline where I just draw every morning for a couple of hours so I can stockpile designs and then sift through what I want to release and what I don't want to release. So that's what I spent my morning doing drawing. I have a swirly dragon. Nike's getting here today. The old Harachis. Haraches. Yeah, that's pretty much it, man. We're like catching up. I am tired though. Like even today, having a hard time logging fully on. So uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's up. I don't feel sick or anything like that. I just feel kind of out of it a little bit so
What up? Wait, you're... There's someone down there. Well, I was stuck anyway. I fucking drove all the way to prime time traffic to the uh, Denver Tech Center to sell my iPad to this guy. How much you sell it for? I didn't even sell it. He didn't meet you there? He fucking stood me up you last night. I'm ready to meet when you are. I'm like, I'll meet you right now, dog. I sold it for a hundred bucks. I unlocked really? it. I figured, uh -huh. well, how's tomorrow morning at the Denver Tech Center? And I'm like, oh, like that's brutal. I have to drive to work. Like I have a job there and I don't. Right, that's $40 Uber right there. So I get there and he doesn't show up and I start hitting him and then I just like thanks a lot dude this at least target has awesome coffee so it was worth the 30 minute trip that i took he's never even wrote me back and then the whole should we dox him i don't know where do you want to eat this place we were gonna eat yesterday that we didn't get to go to that way tuesday or wednesday that it opens i thought it's closed monday and tuesday i will throw this camera across the room <laughs> i swear to god i, I think, think you always do this or i always no. do this yeah well. Fuck. <laughs> oh. damn it let's go look at the print then okay. fuck my life Lucky if I get 70 for that Ultra Boost Lux. Yup. Well, you would always bought that sample for like $400. I know, dude. There's another shoe, too. Oh, like the Ronins. When I was pulling out the Ronins, I was thinking of JC's sample that he bought. Oh, yeah, you got your hose like... on that shit. I remember being jealous. He was like, yeah, you're not coming out. And I was like, oh, fuck. And then they came out yeah. everywhere. <laughs> Including Marshall. I had homeboy order me all those, all these in all the colors last oh, night. Oh, nice. With the discount, they're fucking 80 bucks a pop. That's great. Yeah, so I got four pairs of shoes for the price. It's about all I'm saving is my fifth anniversary is all my Yeezys. You're just a high beast, bro. Well, no, but also my Yeezys don't really have value anymore. The fucking black and white stripe one, the heel is worn down to nothing. The white ones I got married in and they got a little dirty. Nobody wants dirty white Yeezys. Damn. Oh. Lost the side of the car. <laughs> Jesus. Well, I just didn't expect anyone to be behind yeah. me. Yeah. I caught myself. Shit. Car didn't even make a sound, son. So you like the boys? Yeah, so. the first two episodes are good. I got really, really tired last night. Fucking beat. I don't know what's going on. All that vacation. Dude. Yeah, all that vacation. <laughs> I'm just, I don't know how to get back in the groove, I guess. You know? <laughs> I got the final mounts. Oh, hype, shit. Hype mounts. I want to touch it. People hate that I have it. Or talk shit that I have it. Why? Because people, because they, the company is so ridiculous. The shit they say, they're making shoes now. Shoe whatever. Their social media is definitely snorting Adderall. Like, yeah, without a doubt. Splitter allows it to come up on here. No, it's still not showing on the screen. Yeah, it says it's connected. Yeah, and it said Oculus at one point. This part it doesn't connect until it gets through. I don't fucking know. No, it's just because it's streaming and nothing ever works. Test print's been approved. See okay. Signature on that guy saying it's good to go. Just anywhere on it? Yeah, anywhere's fine. Don't go selling this now once we. <laughs> What's going on in the Twitterverse? Okay, I gotta ask your opinion, I guess. You're throwing a party. Yeah. You're throwing a house party. Do you consider everything in the house basically fair game? To other people? Yeah. Well, uh, the answer, I guess, for me is yes, and that is why I never threw a house party because I know it you have no idea. People go through is. everything. Okay. I mean, uh -huh. yeah. Pause. So you're throwing a house party. Two girls are going through your refrigerator drinking your chocolate milk. Are you going to get upset about it? Or no. That's insane. That's the least of my worries. Kids used to take fucking VCRs. The two girls are drinking chocolate milk. I'm not even mad, I think. Yeah, hold on. Let me finish my tweet real quick. <laughs> nice. Let me show you this video. The biggest lesson we've learned in college is to not drink someone else's chocolate milk. Would you grab chocolate milk out of my fridge? It's your fridge? Yeah, it's my fucking fridge. Why would you grab chocolate milk out of my fridge? Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I did not. You didn't know. Like, think about respect and just understanding how shit happens in the world. Like, you don't just go to somebody's fridge. You're at a house party. Ladies. Wait a minute, and here's the thing, dude. When you said house party, I'm thinking high school. I'm thinking high school kids at their parents' it's house. house. It's a fucking for you. It's your fridge. Yeah. You got girls over. They can drink whatever the so fuck they first, want. I don't know if you've ever been to a house party. By the way, this shit has me triggered today. I've been spent so much time on it. And then I just went in. Or and don't like, bug out over, is it the say, don't cry over spilled milk? Yeah, I mean, what, seriously. Like, and I'm just like, I would not let a motherfucker in my house that I wouldn't yeah. give Milk too? <laughs> yeah, especially like two drunk girls until Damn they it. drank. Why your are fucking... you screaming? Because I, I am mad. Carving out this new restaurant. Yeah, we see mad old people outside loving it. I don't know what that means, but get your fucking salsa on. You're really the loudest person. This reminds me of some New York diner shit. Go ahead, show them how you already cut into it before he... <laughs> Is it good? Mm -hmm. Loudest man in the world. Reporting quietly. 
Yeah, that's the quietest you've been. I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. It was delicious. Um, I, I never like hash browns like this from any diner. As good as they are, it's just kind of plain. You're crazy. It's nothing special. It's because you don't get anything to mix it with, and you got a ham and cheese omelet and toast. Yeah, here, drink your black coffee, Mr. Boring. Hey, question. If you are having a house, you are actually gonna probably not answer the way that I, that I would answer, but anyway. If you're throwing a house party. Omar, you're such a dog. Jeez, Mikey. Do you need a knife or something? Oh my god. Let me get you a knife. Oh. What? Dang, look at this box. Ooh, son! It's pretty. There's those cool big balls on the side. Circles. Ooh, circles. Nice. I can't wait to see these things lace themselves. <laughs> this is so silly. I don't think it's gonna be that epic. Oh, it's like a fucking iPod. Foil. Packaging. This is a headband? Oh, it's my charger. It's fucking heavy. I mean, it's prime there right there. So it's cool it's, looking. Yeah, she looks okay. Like I Pikachu. mean, this. Can I come off? It looks like a toy. I would like to pull that off. Investigate later. I want to see them tie and do the stuff. I don't even have the app yet. I don't know how to work these things. What are you fucking crazy? I don't know how to do it. Boop, 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 boop. What? You can just set them on it and it charges? Yeah, I guess that's the only way to charge. The charging pad for my shoe. It looks more and more like an Apple product. Don't throw away that pretty rainbow paper. I want that paper. I mean, Alex, this shoe might not be staying here. You need to calm down. I'm you can get that rainbow paper on fucking <laughs> Amazon for like 45 cents. Why are you mad? I'm not mad. I'm gonna I... stop videotaping for a minute because it's boring. Okay, I'm about to turn them <laughs> on. Uh. For each shoe, press and hold button to power. Whoa, it's like changing colors. Yeah, you can change the colors. Huh? Stop. What the fuck? Did it vibrate? Bluetooth pair. Yes, right shoe. My right shoe is paired, but my left is not. Press either light on the shoe to confirm. I'm walking away from my Hirachi, son. Now, let's dial in the fit. Put on your shoes and find the perfect fit. Oh, boy. Let's get... <laughs> Shit, they don't need to be tightened. Ah. Um. We lost connection, come on now. I mean, they look pretty cool. I think they're a good looking shoe. It's a de- Whoa. Whoa. Adjust your move fit. Oh, so you just slide up this thing. However, however tight or loose you want. It's really tight. It's like your, your step number. What the fuck? You can do move mode and chill mode. But that's my move mode, I'm strapped up. Now when I go to chill mode, I just bring it down to like a 45, you know? That's my chill mode, I don't want to compress, but in case I gotta hit the dash on a motherfucker. I like that you haven't even stood up in them yet. Mm. All right, we're confirmed on chill mode. Your modes, order green. Did that change the color? Mm-hmm. It's a blue? It's blue right now. Green? Now it's green. Yellow? Yep. Blue? Mm-hmm. Pink? Oh, shit! Purple, blue, blue, green. Orange, I don't even know what color, what color you can go with. You can do whatever you want. Do the yellow ones even change color too in the lights? Battery packs. Well, because there's the yellow oh, yeah, pair yeah, too, right? Like they all lights. have rainbow colors. Yeah. The lights don't stay on though. Oh, that's a shame. I mean, it didn't look like it. That must be to take them off. They sound like they're singing a song. Is that all it does? All right, so let's take a step back. Let's see how it fits. Oh. Yeah, I don't hate the look. I fucking cannot stand the fact that this has Nike biggest shit on the back. That tongue comes up really tall. Is that like, uncomfortable at all? No. I just don't understand what the color is so they don't stay lit. I don't even know what the point of it is. Like, what does that matter? I don't know though. I mean, they're pretty comfortable, gotta be honest. They remind me of like an old Andre Agassi looking shoe. God, I hate the Nike on the back. I mean, I guess I hate it. It's minimally branded. I don't hate the shoe. Gotta be honest, I don't hate it. It's gimmicky as fuck. I don't really care about the self lacing part. It's like I'm loosening all the way and then kick it off. <laughs> I just don't understand the lights. Does it light up when I take a step? Nope. What is the point of the lights? Oh, they're sliding right now. Yeah, because I hit the light button. Can you just change the light for a little bit? Pink blast. I mean, they're pretty goofy. It's cool because they make like a little glowing thing on the side of you too. Like yeah, but ground. if I was like at the club, I'd have to take my phone out, pretend I'm texting. Oh, <laughs> check it out. <laughs> Pink on the side, baby. And what happened? Tell well, us. Well, I looked down and I was like, these look weird. And there's just pieces of cardboard in the tongue. <laughs> I just forgot to take them out. But the best part is, is I've already tweeted photos of the shoe and no one has said anything. Cooler without this little panel thing. They do look way cooler without yeah. the panel thing. Put these bad boys back on. Oh, they're way more comfortable without the cardboard and the tongue. I can imagine. They auto-laced, by the way, because I just put them on. 
And then I can say, hey Siri, release my shoes. Tighten my shoes. Abner. Looks like you can't turn on the colors. I'm sure there's gotta be some way. Maybe something I'm not doing. And there's no way you have to just like. Oh, they're on right now. I know, I'm playing oh. the thing. All right, this is the shoe. This is what she looks like. We're not, we don't really do shoe reviews like this, but I feel like this is one that we should probably talk about. Uh, we'll have to break it down piece by piece. So looks alone, a lot of people were like, Teddy, I'm surprised you get the yellow one. Truth be told, I went after both. The white one was the one that I found more striking. It almost looks like a white Power Ranger shoe. Almost reminds me of tribal tattoo shit. The way it flows, but in a different way. I don't know, like something about this shoe, I didn't hate. Just a step in the right direction for me in Nike. Minimal branding, like just a swoosh here and a swoosh here. And this shit says Nike on it somewhere, I think. Maybe on the other one? You can't really see it. Didn't really like this, but now I like the blue and the white. And then this material in the back, the mesh overlay, this is super breathable and like really comfortable. The back heel part, it's super squished. It's like a heel guard on this side. It's like super squished. Like that is really, really comfy. Straight up, nice and breathable and comfortable. And then the rest of the upper is just super sock-like. Obviously why this grabbed me at all, very much like an aqua sock type deal. How the side stretches, it's like a basically an aqua sock with different fusing on top. I like where the things are fused. Again, striking shoe. There's not a bunch of huge swooshes all over it. So um, if this swoosh was not here, I would appreciate it a lot more, but it's there. So it is what it is. You got this crazy hexagon beehive shit, which is kind of fire, but it's cool. Like it's a sock-like upper and without the adapt lacing, it fits really true to size like really nicely. Like it's a really nice fit. Perfect for my feet base. Toes are kind of crammed a little bit. It's a little stuffy in the toe area, like a little, but nothing too crazy. There is a little bit of, I don't know my Nike shit, so I don't know what foam this is, but it is, I didn't realize that, but this is all foamed out. It is a little cushioned. It's nowhere close to boost. It's not even really trying to be boost. So definitely not as comfortable. But the only thing I really noticed as far as stiffness goes pause is where i guess assuming the battery is in the middle you definitely feel like a little stiffness when you're just standing around but i don't really know if that you know it's like not necessarily a bad thing because it kind of creates like a little bit of a squish rock like a squish on the back and a squish on the front it adds a little more support maybe into the mid the, you know the arc of your foot but i don't i don't know if that technology is actually there but it doesn't it's not killing my feet after a couple of hours. So there's that. I don't know. If I take these to Japan and walk around for a day, that would probably be the best way. I can fuck with them, fuck with them. There's an insole. It does come out. It's pretty thin. Yeah, like the BOA system basically you could uncage this, you know, just cut the string. Get you an unadapted. Yeah, the BOA system is cool. I, I don't really like, care. It's a gimmick for sure. The self-lacing thing is a total gimmick. The lights, total gimmick. I don't know if it's necessarily needed. Uh, it's cool. It's like a cool little thing to play with for a minute and obviously people are going to talk to you about it, but I don't really... You'd think that you'd be able to keep these on. I would think you can't as far as I know. It's a pretty comfortable shoe. It's not, it doesn't feel narrow. It doesn't feel narrow like that last shoe that I got. I can't remember the name of it. Um, I, I I like it. I, I like it so far, you know? Like, I think they look clean on feet, for sure. I would prefer in a black and silver colorway instead of a white. Hey, I don't think they're worth 350 you know? Like, you're paying for the gimmicky, which is cool. Again, cool, but even if this was, like, if this shoe existed and there was, like, a pull strap in the back that pulled this boa down or laces down, it would be just as effective to me and just as comfortable and just as cool. So, I don't necessarily, you know, I get it. I get why they're moving into this stuff, but uh, I don't necessarily necessarily think it's the selling point of the shoe. It's comfortable without that. The upper is actually like really, really comfortable, which lends a lot to uh, the, the sole. But yeah, they're okay. I don't know if I'll keep them. I'm gonna wear them a little bit. I might take them to Tokyo. I do feel like that would be a good test. Average of 10 to 12 miles a day, so. Also why I'm continuing to eat like shit, I guess, while I'm home, because I just, I, I don't know. I wanted to eat better and got so much going on and stressed and so much. Rubber toe guard is crazy. That's a cool shoe. So yeah, Nikes, we got a pair that I don't completely hate and that didn't take that long. And they're not even really supposed to combat boost, which they don't, but they're still fairly comfortable. But it is a good looking shoe, you know? It even has like the, not that they're copying Yeezy or Kanye, but like, you know, like the next Yeezys have these wave kind of cuts and everything. Everything's got these cuts. It's really striking. That's the only thing I can say about that shoe. It's very striking and it's not uncomfortable. Yeah, do what you want with that info. I don't know if I left anything out. No extra laces. 
Hey. All right, that's it. I got to go. I'm gonna try and get all this done, edit this vlog, get ready for the rest of the week tomorrow, and try to do VR on Twitch tonight. So I got work. I'll see you guys tomorrow.